Hi, Dan Clark, beautiful Bay Indies, another gorgeous beach day here, but we're here working, selling new homes, folks. Got another nice, nice one, 907 Xanadu, and I have to apologize. I always say drop dead gorgeous, nice, but we've just had some beautiful homes, and this is just another one. Uh, I'm sitting in the screen room. Gene and I were just talking. We could sit down out here in the screen room with the breezes and take a nap. It's just a 79 degrees and a beautiful day. Nice carport covered for one parking. Gina will turn around and show you that area out there. And uh, we've got uh, come pull right up, park. Little side setting area where we are here. We've got the little bamboo shades that come down and block the sun from coming in. Nice little outdoor setting area here. They've redone the stairs here. Nicely done, beautiful setup there. I want to show you the biggest shed I've ever seen in Bay Indies. It's a mother-in-law apartment almost. Your laundry is out here, but look at this. I mean, this is, you can set up housekeeping out here, run a room out. Uh, just nice area out here. The hot water heater looks reasonably new there as well. All nice setup out here. Just huge. If somebody wanted a workshop or set up some type of a game room or craft room or what would you like it to be, or you've just got lots of storage. So you, here it is. Just a nice, very large laundry shed area and uh, lots of storage there. Just another little side thing off another beautiful home here. Home has been vinyl sided. As you can see, we're right at the end of the cul-de-sac. Just one house over from the walking bike trail. So if you've got pets, Bay Indies does allow pets. Great area to bring your dog. Dogs under 45 pounds are, are allowed. We step in through the sliding glass door into a beautiful kitchen. Uh, kitchen's all been updated. Uh, the other thing that they've done in here, they've done sheetrock walls in here, folks. This house has had a lot of time and money put into it. Newer appliances, um, black, get the blackout dishwasher, uh, ceramic top, uh, microwave, uh, the Whirlpool black fridge here, newer sink, new cabinet doors here as well, floors, subfloors have been done. You got a two year old AC unit, uh, roof looks to be in good shape. Uh, it's just the hot water heater is only a couple years old. We just saw that out there. So a nice, very walkable, walk-through galley kitchen. Again, sheetrock walls. Painted up nice, floored up nice, subfloors done. Come in here to the dining area. Got a nice little chair rail around there. Got some upper molding there as well for you. Folks, I got another turnkey house minus a couple of antiques that they're going to be taking out. Um, so most of, your, most of your furniture, with the exception of a couple of the antiques, the antique secretary there, and the antique buffet table, a couple of antique mirrors, and a few things they will be taking out. But living room sets, bedroom sets, dining room sets, uh, pretty much turnkey, minus just the family heirlooms, basically. Again, floors are done in here as well. Uh, sheetrock wall, ceilings painted, fan, nice living room separated from your kitchen area painted up very nicely moldings all the way top bottom chair rail in there got another one eye out here another living room out here for you got uh, six windows here and two more on the front they put a real door in here and again as well done some extra molding done some flooring here as well there is one AC bed that comes out through here, right there behind the drop leaf table. So you do get some heat and air out here. Um, just another living area. They've turned the L&I into kind of a year-round living area and just another TV room. That's where they get their big TV set up there. Painted up as well. Nice French doors here. Again, most stuff standing, but a couple of the antique pieces that are not. Let's make our way down. It's two bedrooms, two baths. And it's, again, painted up nicely. Again, sheetrock walls. This is where the laundry area was. They had the stack unit in there. So if you want to bring your laundry inside, that's where the stack unit was originally. Again, floors are done. We're going to go in here to the guest bathroom. Combo tub and shower. Again, Done up, painted up, chair rail in there as well. Nothing needs to be done in there either. Across the hall, you've got your guest bedroom. 
looks like a double or a queen. I can't quite tell there. Again, the furniture stays, folks. Got a fan painted up, ceilings painted, flooring done. Again, everything you see there will be staying. Make our way into the master bedroom. Got a king size bed in here. Uh, nice setup, poster bed here. And chest of drawers, fan, the curtains, the blinds painted up again as well. All in good shape there. We've got a large walk in closet that goes uh, about six or eight feet in there. So you've got plenty of room, plenty of clothes racks and different things in there as well i'll let gene show you we've got the master bath in here tile floors newer counter got a nice little living closet here newer toilet they got glass doors in here into a tiled shower that's not that old that's recently been done up in there again tile floors mirror Nice master suite, folks. Dan Clark, my Florida dreams. Nice home all the way through. There's nothing you really need to do here but bring suitcase, flip-flops, bathing suit, head to the beach because there's nothing much fear for you to do except write the check. Dan Clark, my Florida dreams. 207-807-7537. I say it a lot. This one will not last. Who's going to get it?